today we wanted to show you how to brew the perfect cup of loose leaf tea. And as you can see, we have a couple options. So let's jump into it. Hi friends, my name is Alicia and welcome to Tea Central. Today I wanted to talk to you about how to brew the perfect cup of loose leaf tea. Often we get customers who come in who are switching from their regular tea bags to loose leaf tea and may find the process a little bit overwhelming. So we just wanted to make that transition as easy and straightforward as possible. So today we're going to be brewing one of my all-time favorite teas, which is the Guangzhou Milk Oolong Tea. You'll find that Milk Oolong has a smooth, buttery, or milky flavor. There's no additives to the tea, it's simply the harvesting and growing process that creates the amazing flavor. Milk Oolong Tea begins its journey in the mountainous regions of China. Depending on the altitude of the tea plantation, the flavor of the leaves may vary a little bit. To enhance the natural flavor of the leaves, they're harvested during the spring and autumn season. They're done at this time of year because there's a perfect combination of cool morning mist and hot afternoon sun. This allows for the leaves to become really thick and fleshy, which in turn allows them to go through a special drying and oxidization process that really brings out that milky flavor. So let's jump into brewing a cup. First, we're gonna take one teaspoon of our leaves and put it in our strainer. Usually we only use about one teaspoon for most of our teas. Next, we're gonna add our hot water. So for our oolong teas, we recommend that your water is just slightly below boiling, usually at about 95 degrees Celsius. This allows you to make sure that your oolong leaves don't burn. We'll have another video later on detailing the importance of water temperature. Of course, you don't have to have a thermometer on hand. I usually let my kettle cool for about five minutes after boiling for my oolong teas. Next, I'll let my oolong teas steep for about three minutes. Sometimes if I'm feeling in a hurry, or let's be honest, a little bit lazy, I'll put my oolong leaves straight in my cup without a strainer. And because of the way the leaves are rolled, most of the tea leaves will settle at the bottom of your cup, which makes it nice and easy to drink. Now that our three minutes is up, we'll pull out our leaves and we can enjoy a soothing cup of tea. Another one of my favorite parts of drinking oolong tea is that I can re-steep the leaves, usually about two, three times. So if you keep the leaves around, you can enjoy a second cup later. Thank you everyone for joining us on learning how to make the perfect cup of loose leaf tea. We look forward to making many more videos like this for you in the future. So if you have any suggestions on what type of video we should make next time, please feel free to leave it down in the comments below. You can also find all our teas and our teaware on our website at teacentral.ca. You can also find all our social media links down in the description below. If you give us a follow, just keep you updated anytime we have any new products available or we have any new videos up. So thank you guys for watching. Is that I can steep the cup. There's a fruit fly in my face. I had that one. <laughs>